No more blue tint. They fixed it, along with a few other updates. Blackmagic just released the 7.3 update for its pocket cinema cameras, which fixes a lot of previous bugs, including the notorious blue tint. Hello everyone, my name is Matt and welcome back to Viva Media. So they finally did it. Blackmagic just released update 7.3 for their entire pocket cinema camera lineup. That includes the 4K, the 6K, and the 6K Pro. There's several minor updates that were fixed. We'll display them all here, but we're gonna go over the major ones that make life on set so much easier. First of all, that blue tint. Some users were reporting a slight blue tint on their onboard monitor on the camera. We didn't really see it on ours, maybe a tiny bit if we're being critical, but it wasn't quite as apparent on some of the others that we saw. But now with the fix that Blackmagic just pushed out, you can simply go into your setup menus and adjust the color and tint of your monitor to whatever you'd like. Monitor calibration, hallelujah. Second, they updated the histograms from luminance to RGB. This was a long awaited change, so now we can see exactly what's clipping or underexposed and know how to adjust our settings accordingly. And just an FYI, you cannot change it back to the luminance histogram. Once you've gone RGB, there's no going back. It's RGB or the highway. Brum, brum. In my mom's car. And last but not least, the new autofocus. Let's be honest, it's not the autofocus you know from Sony or Canon, but it's definitely a much faster autofocus than the previous software. No, we still don't have continuous autofocus, again, like on Sony's or Canon's, but hopefully one day soon Blackmagic will get it together and give us that. This was a very welcomed update, and just these couple of quality of life upgrades are gonna make worlds of difference on set and in the studio. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more videos on black magic and other camera gear, please hit that subscribe button, hit like, and leave us a comment. And if you have a pocket cinema camera, what do you think of this update? Let us know in the comments down below. As always, thank you so much for watching. My name is Matt, we are Viva Media, and we'll catch you in the next video.